Hi, you're watching EWS on OpenDiary.com. How do you like my announcer's voice? Hey, how's everybody doing? Doing well? That's good. That's good. Just thought I'd do a video intro. Haven't done one of these in quite a while. Uh, just got back from the gym. That's why I look a little disheveled. Actually, uh, uh, I could be I, I could be Tigressa, uh, this uh, one of my favorite o o odiers. Just tease, and you know I love you, Tamar. Um, so how are you doing? I think I said already. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. My son uh, came home uh, yesterday. Well, actually, uh, you know, because he's usually with me on Tuesdays. So he, I got home from the gym. He didn't feel like going to the gym. Turns out this chick he likes. Um, he spent an hour and a half with her. Never gone on a date with her before. He comes home and goes, Dad, guess what? What? I have a girlfriend. Didn't you just meet this girl? Uh, yeah. Alrighty then. Yeah, my, for those of you that don't know, my son is 18. Just got his license, driver's license. For the first time, um, last week. Last week he got it Monday. So he's a new driver. One of the advantages of getting your license when you're 18 is insurance. If you get it before you're 18, they really stick you good. If you wait until you're 18 to actually get your license, they give you a little bit of a break. At least that's that's what they told my ex-wife. My ex -wife, uh, my son is actually on my ex-wife's policy. Um, he's got a nice car. Uh, it doesn't look as old as it is. It's a 2000. It has, it has quite a few miles on it. Um, but uh, but it actually looks really nice. I, I have pictures in my diary. I have a picture of it somewhere in my diary. But the problem is with it being old is it's not really worth have, getting full coverage insurance. So the fact that he's 18, he's on um, his mom's insurance, and it's just liability. It's uh, 50 bucks a month. Excuse me. That's not too bad. problem is, though, is his mom doesn't have the money. She got her hours cut um, uh, last summer, towards the end of last summer, uh, because she works in an, in an office that uh, sells um, um, equipment for for construction. And uh, well, you know, <laughs> the construction biz not going that good right now. Um, so they had, he had to cut her hours. Doing justice, he had to cut her hours. So. Uh, so she doesn't have the money to pay for it, and and she shouldn't have to. I mean, he's 18. He's he's you know working his way to being adult here. So he needs to he needs to get a freaking job and pay for his own shit. So he really does. He really does. So he may not be driving if he doesn't get a job. Uh, last weekend when he was with me, I sent him out um, applying for uh, jobs. He's applied like seven different places. The problem is, is he thinks he's like, okay, I did that. Now I can lay back and have fun. No, no, you, you, you keep applying until you get a job. <laughs> that's, that's what I told him. I'm like, you don't just apply to a few places and then sit back and wait. That doesn't happen. You have to keep applying all the time until you get a job. You know, because out of, I told him, like, out of 100 places you apply, you'll get maybe five job interviews. Out of those five job interviews, if you're lucky, you will get a single job. So it's like, he's got to get out there. I mean, and, it, and, and it's not like, uh, you know, he can send in a resume because, you know, he's what, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't have resume quality experience. It's a uh, uh, application. He has to go and fill out an application. So now that he's 18, the kind of the game plan is, is uh, apply all, he, he, he applied a lot of places the last summer um, and, and didn't get a job and ended up volunteering at the YMCA because I made him volunteer. He wasn't going to sit around the house. I guarantee you that. Uh, so this uh, this time around, the plan is for him to uh, uh, apply at all the places you have to be 18. Uh, gas stations, um, Home Depot. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, it was really weird. The uh, Domino's, Domino's Pizza. He had to be 18 to work Domino's Pizza. Okay. I don't quite understand the reasoning there. Excuse me. Like I said, just got back from the gym. Um, what else do we got? What else do we have? What else do we got? Uh, my Christmas is uh, thankfully all done. Uh, gifts and that sort of thing. I, I, all, really, all I have to pay, uh, buy for is my son. 
my wife, she wants to uh, remodel the upstairs bathroom. And so that's our gift to each other. Um, and so, so the good, good thing about that is I don't, I don't have to, uh, I don't have to buy her a gift or only. I'll get her a card, of course. Oh, note to sell. Get Linda a Christmas card tomorrow. Underline. Um, oh yeah, so, so the good, good thing is I don't have to get her a Christmas gift. The bad thing is I have to tear up the stupid carpet and that stupid bathroom because I stupid have to. Actually, we already did the bathroom. Sorry, my mistake. Bedroom. Bedroom. Our bedroom. Our bedroom has carpet. She doesn't like it. She doesn't want it. She thinks it's cause, causing her al allergies to go, go wild. Um, whatever. I like carpet. I like wall-to-wall -wall carpet. She doesn't. She wants wood flooring. We got wood flooring here in the living room. Yes, I'm here in the living room. Want to see the wood flooring? <laughs> okay, good. Get, hope you don't get nauseous. Oh, oh, no. oh I'm getting sick. Ah, there's the wood flooring. Oh, here's a pretty, uh, our pretty fireplace. Linda loves her fireplace. That's faux show. And here we go. We're coming back. Oh, leather couch. And we're coming back. Ah, boom. We're back home. So yeah, that's the uh, flooring that we have here in the living room. She wants the same thing in the bedroom. Pain in the ass. A, I have to tear up the carpet like I covered before. B, I gotta drain and dismantle my water bed. She hates my water bed, by the way. I love my water bed. My water bed is my friend. Um, yeah, so so I gotta just uh, drain and dismantle that thing, and then once it's all done and said and done. Put it back together and fill it back up. That is a pain in the ass. I've done it several times because of moving. Hated it every single time. Love water beds when they're permanent. Um, hey, somebody's moving in. Or actually, probably moving out. You, there's a U-Haul truck outside. Anyway, well, I think that's all I have for now. Let me think. Do I have anything philosophical? No, I don't pretty much a blank slate here. So I hope you guys are having a good time, and I'll talk to you later, or read you later, however the case may be.